what is up YouTube, Demon Sparks here, and today I want to show you guys a little modification I'm going to be doing to this electric scooter. This is in uh, Curry Tech uh, EZIP 400, it's uh, 24 volts, uh, 8.5 uh, amp hour batteries, and so it runs at 24 volts and it goes 13 to 17 miles an hour at 24 volts and I have the batteries hooked up right now like normal it's just on 24 volts and it's on there's no chain and I'm gonna go ahead and hook up the third battery which is another 12 volt 8.5 amp hour it's a lot larger it's a Fisher Price one Probably from a power wheels or something like that, but it's a good battery cell, nothing wrong with it, sealed lead acid, and it's perfect size to fit right in the back, where I can uh, put a basket and or uh, a box with it, rather, and run the wiring. I have some power cable, a lot, a lot, a lot thicker stuff than that. This is, uh, it's got a 40 amp fuse, so I'm hoping I should be able to handle that, but uh, so far it looks fine, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, put the other battery on and be right back in a second. Alrighty, so welcome back, and I have the third battery uh, hooked up in series, so it's now at 36 volts, and I just have the wires ran temporarily until, uh, this is only for just testing purposes, and see if it would actually handle the uh, voltage increase to 36 from 24 volts, and hopefully uh, all I should need is just a 36 volt SLA charger plug, uh, which plugs into there and should still be able to fully charge everything. I read uh, online that some of the ESCs, depending which one you have, will operate at 36 volts to as much as 48 volts. Um, I guess I lucked out since this one appears to run fine at 36 volts. So I'm going to go ahead and turn this on. As you guys can see, the LED light's still there. I'm going to go ahead and wind up the motor. So 36 volts, that's probably a good maybe four to six, 900 RPM more easily. So hopefully we should be able to increase the speed at least by a few miles an hour. As a 12, 13, 14 miles an hour is a little bit slow for my taste, but hopefully we should get a little bit extra speed out of it like this. And uh, I'll have the battery done up differently. And as soon as I get a new tire for the, uh, the rear, and put that all back together so I can actually try uh, test riding it. But like I said, this is only a general demonstration test of uh, running the system at 36 volts and it seems to handle it okay so, so I'll see how it handles it in the long run when I have the tire on when I have the rider weight on and uh, see how everything goes if any fuses blow or anything overheats so hope you guys enjoyed please like and subscribe and show your support and stay tuned